We're here on another beautiful Sunday. Nice breeze on our back. Nice water. Um, just another video to bring the small boats out. Got the Delta Force Mini Sniper and the Mini Dom out just for another play day. So it's just been nice to be back on a regular schedule and get to come out and enjoy my boats. Uh, I'm going to jump back on some builds that I just never finished up. Uh, the Seducer build and the R4 Rigger. And then, I, uh, or maybe before then, I'm going to pull the, uh, the saw boat down. The Zip Kit uh, JAE. And uh, try to get some, some more numbers down. No, get back to those one teens where I was last year uh, and enjoy it. So anyway, let's get these things uh, battered up, taped up, and on the water. Good pool. speed that was the uh, read 53 that's excellent I know we had a wreck but it, I would say 50 mile an hour it's a 50 mile an hour <sighs> RPM, high KV, 4S power, it builds some heat, batteries look alright, Woo! ESCs 150, back of the motor 200, front of the motor 100, but this back side son, 200 degrees, the motor is hot, shocking the yeah, the wires is hot too. We might have had a meltdown if I wouldn't have brought it in. I just, I forgot. This boat probably, this motor is definitely suited for for 3S operation. I think it's a 3200 kV. 
I can't remember right offhand, so it's screaming on 4S. Yeah, we'll let her cool down and play with the mini dime. Wind picked up, but that's all right. Mini dime. Slick. <laughs> so quick. Self right, so fast. If it wasn't self riding, I don't think it'd be as much fun. You can kind of go, uh, just play with it with uh, and uh, an abandon all regard for wrecking. Because even though it's fast, and I mean, 35, 40, 45 mile an hour is still really fast to wreck a boat, but it's built strong. It it self rights almost instantly. Um, and if it didn't, you know, you'd kind of pussyfoot around with it. But it being a 17-inch boat, I mean, just these little ripples might as well be two-foot waves. So, it, uh, it, it just adds to the fun factor that it self-writes and it does it so fast. Because if you were worried about flipping it the whole time you were playing with it, that just wouldn't be much fun. Oh yeah. Where did you find that at? I got it online. That is pretty neat. Yeah, thank you. My girls would like doing that. Yep. So they got them up. You can look on Amazon. They've got some cheaper ones. They got some more expensive. I mean, just whatever you're into, you can spend whatever you want. Right. So. That's pretty neat. Okay. Thank you. Fun. You too. You too. <laughs> so like enjoy your movie and tell them the uh, ticket attendant yeah you too it's like wait he's not seen a movie have fun you too i should have just said yes enjoy your day oh well no but it's always the same thing people speak and say that's cool and like you heard her say my girls would love that everybody says oh my kids would love that my kids would love that. It's like, ugh, you know. I think we're taking on water. It looks like she's trying to sink. I'm glad I was paying attention and didn't just stop to talk. You filling up with water, buddy? You over? 
and you're a slam full of water. Let's see what that's about. Yeah. Slam full of water. Hmm. Wonder what that's about. Oh. There it is. All that talk. How was it the first? I'm glad it was the first spot I grabbed. This epoxy broke loose. I don't know if y'all can see that or not. Right there to the flood chamber. Yep. Yep. Split the seam on the flood chamber. Oh well. Hopefully that'll be an easy fix. Just get some epoxy in there. So it looks fine all the way down. It's just right. From about right here to about right here. This section right here just kind of popped loose. Oh well, we'll get it fixed. Get it back out there. That won't stop us, but just for today.